first that you can take the mask off. Hold on. Wait for everybody, Kaja. Oh, wait. Finally tonight, it took a lot of planning and a trip halfway across the world, but the hardest part was keeping this Mother's Day surprise a secret. How one serviceman pulled it off, and boy, was mom surprised. The tears started falling just after mom, Dina Entz, hit the field at halftime of this Houston Dynamo soccer game. She thought this video from her son Andrew, an airman based overseas, was her Mother's Day gift. But the real gift was running up behind her. United States Air Force Staff Sergeant Andrew In. I had no idea. This has got to be the best Mother's Day present ever. It was priceless. It was like a moment I'll never forget. Uh, just seeing her, uh, her face and uh, the look and the expression on her face and how, how excited she was. Andrew is based in South Korea and hasn't been home in eight months. So being here today for Mother's Day and for church with his parents and sister is special. So we weren't expecting him to come home until uh, December. Across the country, service members surprising their moms. Staff Sergeant James has just returned from Afghanistan to be Staff Sergeant Marquita James surprised her mother, a single mom of two, who was about to receive a master's degree from Brunel University in Georgia. Back in Houston, the Enses are making the most of Andrew's surprise visit. Brunch with extended family, particularly sweet since Andrew has rarely made it home in the past five years. Andrew and his mom get three weeks together this time, a visit the two will now never forget. It's been hard, but you know, I know that Andrew is in a good place. I miss him tremendously, but I know he's happy doing what he's doing, serving our country and protecting our freedom. And from everyone here at ABC News, a big hug to all the moms out there. GMA first thing in the morning, and David Muir is right back here tomorrow night. I'm Tom Yamas in New York. Have a great evening. Good night. Kay Ann Wright walks toward her daughter's classroom with the aid of a crutch following a recent accident when she broke several toes. But that injury couldn't slow her down on this day. Daughter Kaylee Donaldson, this week's star student, got to have Daddy be today's royal reader for her kindergarten class. Both are about to be happily surprised. <laughs> Kaylee runs to Mama's arms for some love as her classmates and teachers cheer. Mission accomplished. Daddy and daughter were certainly surprised. Mommy was a big surprise. Huh? Were we worried? You were worried about mommy? You were a star student? High five! Soon the happiness of this 9-11 military homecoming spills into the hallways. The Air Force veteran and her family are showered with thanks and praise and welcome home cards. Oh, I'm overwhelmed right now. I am. <laughs> Been away for seven months and being able to touch her and my husband is awesome. I couldn't be more blessed right now. Her normally outgoing kindergartner seems a little overwhelmed by all this attention, but she's certainly happy mom's back home. I like mommy when she comes home. Were you surprised? It was very difficult, especially whenever Kelly miss her and she wants her mom and there's nothing I can do for her just to comfort her and uh, yeah, show her mom and be home real soon. That homecoming is on 9-11, which just happens to be the seventh anniversary of Kay Ann Wright joining the Air Force. We appreciate them every day, but when we have the opportunity to participate in a homecoming, it just kind of brings it home how much we do appreciate what they do for our country. In Biloxi, Steve Phillips, WLOX News. So we're here to welcome home Kandero from Afghanistan. There's a sign. The kids don't know. Wait, 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 wait. Hold on. I'm going to put you guys in the 
got it down for a little snack. You guys want a snack? It's here, Emma. Yeah. Here, go sit at your table so I can get you guys a snack. They're just chilling. You know, it's girls' night. Don't worry about them. Here, you guys sit down right here. Uh-oh, it's going off. What's going on? Hey, you guys sit down. Who's what is that? Who's calling you guys? Look, Look. here. Let's sit you guys. He said that. I got in last night. I wanted to surprise you. Well, you sure did. <laughs> Where's your mother? I'm somewhere in there. I think she was. She blowed her in her hair. Look. Well, don't come out good to but <laughs> A handshake won't get it, buddy. Bless your heart. I am thrilled to death to see you. Gosh, you're a good looking, right? <laughs> Thank you, Grandpa. Well, thank you very much. It's been a couple months. <laughs> yes, it has. But up almost five, isn't it? Yeah, it's been almost five months. Well, 20 weeks. Yeah. The quick workout calendar. Well, I sure weeks. didn't expect to see you walk in here. <laughs> wow, this is a surprise. Golly, I'm sick. Thrill to death. <laughs> I thought you were going to have your graduation today. Nope, I had that Wednesday. Well, did, uh, uh, what's your name? Teresa. Teresa, did get there? Yeah. Oh, great. You got there, yep. Well, you're out. For a while. I, yes, I am. I, I have a question cold. for you. Yes, sir. <clears throat> this reserve unit you're in up here, what kind of reserve is it? Infantry to engineers? or? I think it's just an engineer company. I don't know the details. I don't know if it's heavy equipment, I don't know if it's combat engineers. I don't know the details. I've been trying to call them because I need to get with them in the next 72 hours yeah. and give them my paperwork. Yeah. And they're not answering their phone. I don't know. So I'm trying to get all that figured out, but I don't. It smells good. Oh my god! <laughs> 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 Oh, yeah, cool. oh my god! Oh my god! Oh yeah, Dad, we got a handsome guy's picture. 
we've been, been lying, lying to you guys, guys for like a month. Before Dad's birthday. You guys know? Yeah. Like every time Dad would say, oh, "I wish Zach would come home," when he's texting me, and Pennsylvania, oh, oh yeah, God. me too. That sucks. Like, you know, just trying to juice Look it up. Look at Zach. I said we're gonna put your picture in your chat tonight. Oh my God. How long you home for? Uh, just Wait. just till Sunday. Where'd you just get him? Oh, I just I got out. him at the airport. Yeah, I don't know why we did this. You I did? I was going to get Zach at the yeah. airport, but I wanted, That's why I say to Kevin, Kevin, Kevin worked school. last night. Oh! So oh I stayed God, at the airport to go get him. <laughs> oh my God, we got to get a picture. <laughs> and now, ladies and gentlemen, we ask that you direct your attention to the 50-yard line. Tonight at Pickerington High School North, we are helping our friends from Grove City in a special Welcome Home celebration. Returning from his third deployment in the Middle East is Staff Sergeant Raymond Kramer of the 718th Army Reserve Unit out of Rickenbacker. <laughs> Staff Sergeant Kramer arrived today. His return home in attendance here this evening is a complete surprise to his daughter and Grove City Band member, Sky Kramer. Please join us in welcoming Sergeant Kramer back to Columbus and thanking him for his service to this great country. Mm-hmm. <laughs> 